And Joe's gonna have fun editing this one. <laughs> He's gonna be like, what the hell are you doing? Asher, man, what are we getting now? A bird feeder? Aw, oh, sweet. This is gonna look so good. We can watch the birds from the window. Okay, let's see if we can get it set up. We got mommy here. We got all these contraptions. That one is for a hummingbird. Two thirds part water, one third part concentrate, or half and half. Whatever, you know, we're not trying to be too picky here. And we're gonna track some birds. I don't think anyone needs to try to be like anybody else. If you're trying to be somebody else, that's gonna come across and people are gonna feel that like, oh, like the, the fakeness. But when you are being undeniably you and you are passionate about what you're doing, people feel that. It, it hits different. This is it. This is the new direction. Hi, hello. Welcome back to the channel. How's it going? Okay, you guys. Today's video might be a little bit of a hot mess, okay? We're, we're just gonna go with it because I have nails that need pop, pop, because I have nails that need polished. Yeah, we need to get something on these babies. And I have wine. Where's my wine nose? <laughs> it's been a long week, don't you judge me. So we are doing nails with some wine. So this could be fun. I was browsing through what I wanted to do for my nails and I'm browsing through all these fun like summer colors, summer nails. And that's what I was looking up on Pinterest. I'm like summer nails. And I kept finding all these bright colors and they were beautiful. But you see, I just did those bright multicolored nails for Florida. And so now I'm like, I'm migrating back to black. Black like my soul. <laughs> wine hasn't even been cracked yet and we're already hot messes so it's fine but anyways um yeah I'm, I'm feeling black like I was just scrolling and then all of a sudden I seen this picture this picture sucks this picture sucks me back into the black cat claws every time every time all the rings all the, the fancies I'm just like mm, yes on my but I don't want to do just black I, I want I mean I want like just black I want to use just black polish, but I seen a couple different pictures. So I seen this and then I also seen this one. That one's really pretty. And then I also seen this one. I know this isn't black. This is white, but this gave me an idea. I don't have these little fancy strip things for the designs, but um, I have wine and I have painter's tape and scissors. So why not? <laughs> this open. Here we go. Cheers. Oh, that's Moscato too. I'm not a dry wine person, y'all. Fancy schmancy video. This many drinks before I start? Alright, I have to go get the painter's tape. Ha! Hello, pulpit. Okay. So, I am all set up here. If you can see this little setup, I literally have like all of my lights back here on. I've got my big ring light set up over here. I've got my phone set up right here because I'm gonna show you guys like behind the scenes. We're gonna do some dual camera action here. Yeah, so I'm gonna use this black polish. This is actually one of the gel polishes that came in that set that I reviewed um, before we left for Florida. The gel polishes, so you do need like a UV light or whatever to cure them. So yeah, this is the black polish I'm gonna use. I'm gonna use the the shiny top coat, I really want to use the matte top coat, but matte, I feel like matte, the, the matte top coat, I feel like it only looks good for a couple days and then once it gets like beat up and scratched and stuff, it doesn't look good anymore. So we're gonna go with shiny. Um, so what I'm gonna start off doing first, I am going to paint my pinky and my thumb and I'm gonna do it solid black because I think I'm gonna do some kind of design some kind of some some on the three middle fingers. I think, I think that's what we're gonna do. I don't know, I may end up doing like a solid color on this one and then doing designs on these. I don't know. We're just gonna go with it and see what happens, okay? Okay, a wee bit more wine. Did I mention I'm a lightweight? I don't, I don't hardly ever drink anymore. Like, hardly ever. Here we go. So we're gonna try to sync these up here. Face ID for my phone. My phone's sideways, so I had to turn my face sideways and it still recognized me. <laughs> All 
All right, here we go. Let's shake up the gel polish. Shake up, shake up, shake up. So we are taking the black polish here. And in this particular set, this polish is number 31. Let's just not talk about, like, if you guys can see this, uh, the whole uh, how dry and crusty my cuticles are. That's because I just used acetone to make sure there was no, like, oils or anything on my nails. So they be looking real haggard right now and real, like, crusty and gross. <laughs> okay, anyways, I feel like I should start on my right hand and use my left hand to polish because this is only going to get worse as we go here. So let's start with this one. <laughs> oh, the one thing I hate about polishing with black polish, if you mess up, it sucks. I've noticed at the salon that it's always important to like get the edges and even like this tip right here. Just like that, Ooh. <laughs> just like, just like so. <laughs> um, okay, hold, hold, I'm gonna, <laughs> you guys, I can't, I don't even know what I'm doing. I don't, I've had one glass of wine, good lord. Good lord. <laughs> I'm literally like profusely sweating right now. Okay, then we're gonna go ahead and come over here to the thumb. So I like to go all the way across the top here and try to get this all like nice and uh, seamless, I guess you could say. Oh, come on. Black nail polish is, it stresses me out. I love the way it looks when it's done, but I don't like to be the one to polish it. I'm not even filming what I'm doing. Like my, <laughs> my thumb's like up here, the camera's down here. Okay, anyways. All right, there we go. There's the pinky and the thumb. We're gonna go ahead and we're gonna stick it in here and cure this sucker. You know the, okay, pardon. <laughs> you know the real reason I like black nail polish so much? Because I use pink shampoo, and even when I didn't use pink shampoo and my hair was blonde, I used purple shampoo. And all that <laughs> stains your nails like crazy. Like you can have like pink or whatever, yada yada, like, what have you, but it stains your nails. It, it doesn't matter. It, it always like alters the color a little bit. So black, black, it don't alter shit with that. <laughs> <laughs> One thing that's been nice, not necessarily having to rep cert, like a, any certain makeup brand or anything like that is I know, I know I've taken a break on like lives from like my Facebook and my TikTok and stuff like that. And I'm gonna get back to it. I am. I've just been crazy busy, hella busy with everything. And, but what's been nice is feeling like I don't have to document every damn time I do my makeup. Like, <laughs> I do have to say, I do have to say, whenever, like, when I was with pharmacy, I felt like because I was selling makeup, I felt like every time I did my makeup, I had to f either film it or go live or do something. And because that pressure is off and now I'm like, hey, I don't have to do this. <laughs> I think I just needed a nice little break from it. <laughs> I've been getting back to just like having fun with makeup and hair again, which has been feeling really good, mind you. I, I don't know, I don't know. I think I think I'm about ready to dive back into lives and just like have fun with it. Cause y'all know I'm, I'm all about the fun, all about the fun. <laughs> yeah, no, I was gonna say wine and hair, but that, that's just not a good combo. That's, that's heat on my hair, wine, not focused. Like that's, no, no. All right, top coat, here we go. And again, this is the top coat from that same gel set that I got. Hopefully you guys can see what I'm doing here. The accents, the weird voices and accents will get thicker and thicker as, as I go with my wine here. <laughs> okay, so I'm making sure with my clear coat that I'm even like going around the edges and sealing that. My hands look so dry and crusty. It is like grossing me out right now. <laughs> I'm like looking at it through the, like through my camera or my phone camera here and I'm like, <laughs> Any of y'all that sit and watch this whole video, like, God bless y'all. <sighs> I feel like all I have been seeing all over TikTok right now is the uh, NSYNC song, It's Gonna Be Me. Because when he says it, he's like, it's 
gonna be me. <laughs> See, I wanted to get these done so I wasn't like messing these ones up while I was doing the other ones. See, I have a bunch of crap like all around my nails here if you can't see, but it's fine. I'll clean it up after. As long as I get all that gunk stuff off there, we're good. Okay, so I'm gonna let these cure. I'm gonna probably put a little bit of cuticle oil on them when they, on the ones that are polished when they come out. And then I'm gonna start on the other ones. Okay, I have electrical tape. Thought we had painter's tape, definitely don't. But we have electrical tape. Is this gonna work? I don't really know what I'm doing, you guys. <laughs> We're just trying stuff, okay? So this one, cut a strip like this, and I made it diagonal because I kind of want this I, I don't know. We're just gonna line this up, okay? Do as I do, not as I say. Will it look good when I peel it off and the polish is on there? I don't know. I don't know, we're just going with it. Then, so that this is not in the way, we're gonna cut this, because otherwise it's gonna be sticking everywhere. I'm trying to decide if this is gonna stick on there or if I'm gonna need to recut one. Don't don't judge my, my vanity here. It's got makeup and earth thing. Okay, what is what do we think? Is that gonna look good when I peel that off? Okay, so I'm not having like a ton of excess polish on here, and I'm not like completely polishing over this, because I'm scared it'll like seep through. So I'm just kind of starting right at that edge. So then we're gonna go on the edges here, right underneath. Okay, okay. I really hope this works. Okay. We're gonna cure this, we're gonna put a second coat on, and then we're gonna peel it off. Hi, I'm just waiting. It's almost done! All right, here we go. Peeling the tape off. What do we think? Place your butts. Okay, it's not terrible, but it's still jacked. <laughs> okay, well shit. Where's the acetone? Don't spill, Tori. Will this work? I don't know. Probably not with my look. So what I'm trying to do here is I'm trying to put acetone on this little tiny makeup brush to try to get all this uh, excess polish here off. All else fails, I'll grab my nippers here and I'm just gonna scrape it off. I don't know. Okay, got that. Okay, I have to hold this up closer to my face because I can't see it through my phone right now. What is wrong with me? Why did I think this was a good idea? <laughs> I'm real aggravated. Okay, I'm thinking on the next nail, we're not gonna use tape, or we might just freehand it, and that might go even worse. <laughs> okay, well after scratching all of the excess stuff that I didn't want on there off, this is what we're, what we're left with. Okay, well, let's just put a clear coat on and see what it looks like, shall we? <laughs> Got the top coat on it and I just took it out of the uh, light here. Didn't turn out like perfect perfect like I wanted it to but it's still cute but it also led me to the conclusion that I'm not gonna try the whole like three line thing. Yeah we're not gonna try that. No. Nope. Nope. We'll probably do the design like some other design right here on the middle and then I think I'm just gonna do a solid black on the pointer finger. I think three was overshooting. <laughs> Bottoms up. Definitely went with the solid black on this one. Now this one here, I'm thinking of doing kind of just like a black tip on it, kind of like this one here, but without this at the top. And I thought about doing like a couple dots, like the one picture, like this one, yeah. But I don't know. We're gonna see how just doing the tip of it goes here. All right, well, I forgot to hit record. <laughs> I am a hot mess right now. Like, look at the black polish all around this one. I tried freehanding this one. Probably not, not the best decision with uh, two-thirds of a glass of wine. Two-thirds of a bottle of wine. Okay, we're gonna go on the edge here. Yep, got more black polish on me. And then I used a makeup brush to try to get some of the black polish off, and apparently the makeup brush had black product in it. I'm just a whole train wreck right now. Here's what we got so far. So we're gonna put <laughs> we're gonna put this in the light and cure it, get a second coat on, and we're gonna see what this looks like. I feel like this is a fail. I don't know. Okay, here's what I did on the middle one. They didn't turn out exactly how I wanted them. 
I, I'll, I'll be lucky if I leave these two, these design ones. They're okay, but, um, I don't know. Tomorrow they might get buffed off and just end up solid black. <laughs> and you guys, I did not film doing this nail because it was quite literally like impossible. The way I had to hold my hand, I couldn't keep it under my camera. Otherwise it would have been a squiggly line everywhere. And yeah, so on this hand, when I go to do this design on this hand, I will try to show you <laughs> if I can hold my hand right. Okay, so I'm not gonna make you sit through this whole other hand of seeing this, but this is, this is what we ended up with so far, okay? I'll come back after this hand and we're gonna see where we're at. This is where we're at with this. It's empty and I got this much left. Okay, we're back. I got these ones done. <laughs> Um, here we go. This hand here, obviously. This one's done. Okay. This one we're working on. And I'm just finishing this nail, but I wanted to show you guys because I didn't show you on this one. So, this nail here. We're going to do this design. Hopefully it turns out better than this one did. Still don't know if these are going to stay or if they're just going to go all black. Starting the video here. Yes, my, my paper towel is very much so a lot more dirty than it was when we first started. So I'm taking this little skinny brush here and I'm getting black nail polish on it. We are just starting on the outer edge here. Might be a little bit better on this hand because, well, I'm actually using my right hand. I am only using makeup brushes that I really don't, <laughs> that I really don't use a whole lot. Um, if I use these a whole lot for my makeup, or at all for my makeup. I probably wouldn't be using this with nail polish. You can do it. <laughs> okay, this one went so much smoother. Wipe off the excess, and then we're gonna actually take the nail polish brush, go underneath here. All right, does this look similar? No, not really. <laughs> like, does this look similar? <laughs> okay, well, it's, it's fine. This one looks so much better. I wish I was ambidextrous. Yep. That's how you say it, right? Ambidextrous. All right, we're gonna let this cure. Second coat. I'm gonna go to bed. This is the last of that bottle. Okay, second coat on here. Look at how much better that one looks than this one. So we are going to, so you gotta get enough product on the brush here. You can see that to make the dot. Ta-da! <laughs> All right, <laughs> there we go. Let's go ahead and cure this, shall we? All right, we are gonna put the clear coat on here. I feel like this middle nail here with the little V tip and the three dots, like it looks like a little tuxedo. <laughs> I just need to add a bow tie on the top. <laughs> oh, like tell me that, that don't look like a tuxedo. Okay, we are curing the top coat on there. I don't even know what time it is, you guys. But <gasps> Apparently it's um, almost 2.30 in the morning. 2.30 a.m. Okay. Okay, we're done. Wait, wait, wait. I mean, they don't look terrible. We're doing this with a bottle of wine. It wasn't bad. <laughs> so yeah, here we go. Here we have it. I feel like I'm never like a huge fan of designs and I always end up changing them. But well, I'll let you know how long they last. After I see them tomorrow in bright daylight, I'll let you know. Otherwise... <laughs> I need to go to bed, <laughs> 2.30 a.m. Hopefully you guys found this um, entertaining, if nothing else, because, you know, why not? <laughs> if you guys got any other ideas for me, any other uh, designs you want to see me try, let me know. And I'll see y'all next video. Don't forget, if you had some fun with me, hit that subscribe button. <laughs> Cheerio! <laughs> <laughs>